Let's fill our car with a bit of printer ink. There we go. I'll go for a ride. Hopefully we get somewhere with this. Something seems to be happening. Look at that. This 2106, I mean to say this 2105 is making quite a smoke show. There you go. What up, fellas? I just want to say, big thanks to you guys for keeping those suggestions coming. So recently a couple of people posted this here video to our timeline on VK. Honestly, I was laughing my ass off watching this. It was pretty awesome. Anyway, no time to think. Let's just make it happen. So we've bought ourselves... As you might have guessed by watching that video, those dudes poured some printer ink into the fuel tank, which led to the exhaust pipe spitting out plumes of multicolored smoke. Maybe we can achieve the same result. I say we give it a try and find out for ourselves whether this is all true or not. Let's do this. What happens when you fill the tank with printer ink? Translation and voiceover by BMI Russian. I've removed the hood, just to keep everything in plain sight. We're not too keen on pouring this stuff into the fuel tank. I mean, God knows what that could lead to. So right here I've got a plastic bottle, which I'm about to fill with some gas, while adding a bit of ink into the mix. Then we connect it to the carburetor, and just look on to see what happens. Nice! It works! Okay, I'm not even gonna switch the car off. We'll start with a bit of red. Right, let's fill our car with a bit of printer ink. There we go. Okay, and straight away we run into trouble. I should stop right there. This is pretty pointless anyway. You see that? It doesn't want to dissolve in gasoline. No worries, I guess. Let's rev it up. Something's happening. Come on now. Oh man, this is such a long hose. Now it doesn't want to come down. Then again, these are water-based. What's up? Are we seeing any red smoke? Oh, come on already! Okay, so this isn't working. Let's try something different. What do we got back there? White smoke? Why is it white? It's supposed to be red. Yeah, it's kind of a bluish white, but it still hasn't gone red. Though we've already emptied half a bottle straight into the intake manifold. So it made it inside the engine. But for some reason we aren't seeing any red smoke. We do have one more option, though. We could try this stuff. The yellow ink. Let me just get it open. I say we... add it to the fuel supply as well. What's wrong? That's a bright color. Lovely. No. This is pretty trippy. Check out the color of this fuel. You know what? That's actually a good thing. Come to think of it, I should probably drive around a bit. Maybe that'll get us somewhere. Let's do this. Okay, what do we got back there? Something seems to be happening. Oh yeah, for sure. Nice! We've got a ton of smoke back there. I can see it in the rearview mirror. So much smoke. 
So much smoke. Bomb, 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 bomb. This is pretty neat. It actually works. We've burned through that batch. Now let's try some of this stuff. Double down on the color. Now this is some blue ink. Time to pour it in. Look at that. All blue and everything. Great. Not sure what color the gasoline is. Well, let's do this. That's a nice little smoke cloud. I'm definitely a fan. Now let's check the other mirror. Wow, that's pretty cool. Now that's how you make colored smoke. Though we are getting a pretty nasty smell. Quite awful indeed. Eh, whatever. Hopefully I don't suffocate to death. Are we gonna see any red smoke today or what? Maybe we should pour in some red stuff, like a healthy dose, to get some intense red coloring going. I think we should give it a try. Wow, guys, the smell is actually pretty awful. But in any case, what sort of color was that? I'd say greenish. Greenish. Some sort of acid green, yeah? I think we should add some red. Like, pour in everything we've got. So now we add a touch of red. There we go. This should be hella fun. All right. Something's up. Come on. Let's go. Show us some smoke. This actually works really well. It all worked out beautifully. What if I... This 2106, I mean to say this 2105 is making quite a smoke show. Fantastic. Looks like we're done. There you go. All right, fellas, that went really well. We kept adding a bit of color into the mix, and we actually did see some colored smoke coming out from the exhaust. But if I'm being serious, did you guys actually believe that? Don't get me wrong, the smoke was real. But it was actually coming from these here smoke bombs. Here we have some green smoke, red, and some orange. As for coloring gasoline, seems like a bunch of bullshit to me. Okay, so first off, this ink is some sort of water-soluble deal. I don't exactly remember what it's called. Whatever the case may be, you can't really mix it with gasoline. Even when we squirted it straight into the carburetor, when it was in fact making it to the combustion chambers, all we got as a result was steam. Since we are talking water here, it evaporates and all you get is steam. Now, if I can just demonstrate to you how we made it all work, we still have a few left over that we didn't use. This one is pink. Uh, that should work. Now we just stick it in there, we secure it using this metal rod, and now it's not going anywhere. Okay, then we light it up. Start the car, man. And this is what we end up with. Looks pretty good, right? Now we've got plenty of smoke coming out from the exhaust pipe. Nice, eh? It is pretty cool to look at. And if you stick a couple of different ones in there, you will get multiple colors, like we saw in that video. Switch off the motor. Then again, just hit the gas. It'll fly out. 
That's it, you can switch it off now. And now we... What do we got here? This one is blue. And this one is purple. They are slightly different, so... Okay, start the car. We've got plenty of color coming out of there. You can see a bit of blue and a bit of purple, as is to be expected. Don't rev it too hard, though. This is pretty neat. There you go. Two colors at once. And that brings us to the end of this experiment. Switch it off, dude. Let them burn out on their own. They actually still have some life left in them. Rev it just a bit harder. That'll do. There they are. Our smoke grenades. Okay, guys, well, at least this experiment has revealed that you can't use gasoline to dissolve ink. But these here smoke grenades did help us make this look a lot more epic. And that's pretty much all I have for you. If anybody knows how to wash this ink off, please let me know in the comments. Okay, fellas, watch our videos, subscribe, send in those suggestions, and check us out on Instagram. Alright, catch you later. Now I gotta wash this off somehow.